What's up? Hey, what up, guys? I'm Richie Lee, and I'm Vietnamese. I know I always say that, right? Well, you talk about it all the damn time. And I want to talk to you guys about a part of my college experience, which was VSA. Vietnamese Students Association. Oh yes, VSA. It's a club that most colleges have that is aimed at preserving the Vietnamese culture and heritage. And I know some of you guys are probably saying right now, Oh man, VSA man, that's y'all man. Y'all do you man, I do me man. That's corny man. Nah. If you're not in college yet and you're thinking about joining, or if you're in college right now and you can't decide whether to join or not, I'm gonna give you five reasons to join VSA. Learning about the culture. Nah, I'm not into all that culture stuff. That's corny. I mean, yeah, if learning about your background and where your parents come from is corny. Now, I'm not saying you have to put on an ao and go on stage and dance with the rice hat. What I'm saying is you'll be able to meet people from similar backgrounds and learn from their perspective. And more than likely, your VSA will have different fundraising events such as Vietnamese cultural shows, Fu King, selling Vietnamese food, and you cannot forget the Vietnamese club night. And you know Vietnamese like a good club night. And if you're not Viet, well it's a great way to learn about a unique culture you might not be familiar with. You actually might be pretty surprised how diverse your VSA is. I guarantee you will not be the only non-Vietnamese person there. You are not alone. I am here with you. UNASA conference. Alright guys, so every year there's this huge Vietnamese conference where people from all over the country go to learn about their culture, to attend exciting workshops, and basically just kick it with a bunch of other VSAs. A conference? Nah, man, I ain't down with all that. Hey, Trung, there's a lot of girls there, though, man. Hey, yo, hold up, bro. You said girls? And I know a lot of cool kids probably think they're too cool to go to events like this. Well, you're not, man. It's actually cool meeting new people, getting involved, and learning about your culture. And don't worry, it doesn't overlap with EDC weekend. Leadership opportunities. Have you ever wanted to be the president of something? <laughs> Me? President? Oh, yeah. Or maybe a committee chair member. Anytime you take up a leadership role within your VSA, you can learn about organizing events, managing your peers, fundraising, a whole lot of things you can learn. This is a great way to familiarize yourself with different leadership roles before you enter the real world. Overall, you'll be meeting a lot of new people that can lend a helping hand to whatever you're trying to pursue in the future. And last but not least, it's a lot of fun. Unlike a lot of college clubs, I would say VSA really just feels like you're hanging out with a bunch of friends. Who knows, you might even meet your future boyfriend or girlfriend there. Oh, Quack, he's so dreamy. Have you ever been around a bunch of Vietnamese people? You guys can laugh about being Vietnamese together. And don't act like that's not funny sometimes. Alright guys, remember, you do not have to be Vietnamese to join a VSA. I've met Filipinos, Chinese, white people that really wanted to join just because it's a unique experience. And you know, if there's not a VSA at your school, I still encourage you to join an Asian club. Maybe even start your own VSA. Alright guys, I'm really glad I ended up joining the VSA. I'm really glad that I stepped out of my comfort zone. At first I thought it might have been a little corny, but at the end of the day, it was totally worth it. I mean, you guys gotta join now. Peace! And no, this was not sponsored by VSA. I just wanted to make it. Hey, what up guys? I hope now you join a VSA. I know it helped me a lot. I'm getting the ladies now. <laughs> Shout out to all the VSAs out there. Please share this on your wall so you can encourage a lot of people to join.